when declaring a function in JavaScript, you actually have the ability to pass certain arguments or parameters to that function that'll make it more useful in a variety of situations. Let's consider my example. I created a function called mating call, and it simply executes two different alerts. Now, this is a very a generic sort of function where, or actually limited sort of function, because it's always going to spit out the same thing. But say that I wanted to use this mating call function on my page in a couple different places, each time uh, defining certain names that I want the message to put out. I don't want it to just say, hello, is it me you're looking for? I want to actually use someone's name after hello, but multiple times in different scenarios. So. In order to do that, I need to define uh, arguments for my uh, function over here. So let me go inside of the parentheses mating call. I'll go you, comma, me. I just made these up. And these are parameters that I'm going to pass inside the function. So now let's consider I want to put hello, the you person, because that's who I'm going to say. So plus you and then it says hello you and and that is got an error somewhere oh need another plus so that's gonna pass the you down there and then alert no instead of saying creep I'm gonna say me plus me and of course we need the exclamation point so now what happens is, is that my on click function, I need to add a little something to it. And those are the specific parameters that I want to pass to this function. So let me go in, well, I'm going to need to use single quotes since I double quoted that. I'll go um, Devin as my first parameter. And then the f second one will be Dragos. So let's look at when I execute this code, when I go click me, it says, hello, Devin, is it me you're looking for? And I click OK, it says, no, Dragos. Well, there you go. So, of course, uh, I'm going to put a little space here. Of course, the whole point of creating a function with these parameters is that you could use it in different scenarios. 